hey guys welcome back to my channel and it's great to have you here once again and if you're just seeing my face for the very first time my name is jennifer confidence and i'm a 2020 erasmus Mundo scholarship i will be yes 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 scholar <laughs> Okay, guys, so in my last video where I talked about, you know, meeting my colleagues, meeting my Dublin coordinators and eating raw meat, eating raw beef, I pointed out that my clothes embarrassed me along the line. My clothes embarrassed me. And so <laughs> that's what I'm here to talk about today. So I'm actually dressed exactly the way I did that day, exactly the way I did that day. And um, hmm. so basically, this was what I wore. Like, this is exactly how I looked that day. This was what I wore. This is exactly how I looked that day. And we went out. How do I look? <laughs> so, yeah, this is exactly how I looked. We went out. But, 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 my village people wanted to embarrass me. My village people wanted to embarrass me. Don't this look nice? It looked nice. Because it was just an evening drink. It looked nice. Just normal. That was exactly how I was dressed. Like, as I'm dressed right now, that's exactly how I was dressed Um, a couple of days ago. A couple of days back. So, the thing with it was that I just got the palazzo newly like i just got it literally got it maybe a day or two before that day i just got it newly and so i didn't remove the tag you know there's usually tag that comes with clothes and all that i didn't remove the tag so that day i got dressed and just wore my palazzo just wore it like that and went out so i didn't i didn't i forgot that the tag was there or something but it was inside when i was going so when i got there i noticed that oh I, I was feeling something, so I touched it and I realized that it was the tag. I was like, ah, no, well, like, the tag is inside the clothes. So, it shall no big wahala. So, then later on, I stood up to go and ease myself. I went to, after using the bathroom, did everything. Dressed up back now. Norma came back. I sat down. I didn't realize that the tag was out. Like the tag was literally out. So I came back, I sat down. And all the while that I sat down there, I was standing up, going, standing up. Like if somebody wants to pass, I'll stand up. You know, just be doing shakara, I'll stand up, I'll do this, I'll stand up. Ha! Huh. And all this while, there was a lady sitting beside me from another end. She was not on our table, from another end altogether. And you know, the lady was just looking at me in a funny way. I didn't know why she was looking at me in a funny way. I was like, ah, why this old lady just looking at me like this? With ah, why that kind of something, but I shall just maintained. I was like, It's a business, me. I don't shall know what she's looking at me like that. Ha! Ah, until my um, my table people they said, Let's go. As I stood up, I wanted to do my trouser away. I realized that my tag was out. Ah, 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 hey, God, oh, the embarrassment. And I was, I felt like. Oh my God, was this why this lady was looking at me since? Was this why? And I felt like, you know that kind of something, something happens to you and I start feeling like maybe other people saw it. So I felt like, ah, maybe all this, my other colleagues that were sitting down here, all the while I've been standing and going, standing and going, maybe they've been seeing it and they refuse to say anything. So it's me now that was just reasoning all these ones in my head. You know, on a normal, what I've noticed here is that people don't really, it's not their business, it's not their business, you grab Maybe in such a way not to make you feel bad or feel somehow, yeah, that kind of something. So I felt in my head, I was like, ah, maybe all my colleagues, they saw it finish and they just kept quiet. And there was one of my colleagues that was telling me, ah, she loves my trouser, I look nice. All the people were telling me they love my trouser, they did the... Ah, I said, wait, oh, did these people see the tag? Hey, God, oh, by me, I have entered one chance. So the day that I said, let me do baby girl for life, come out and was doing melanin popping, was, you know, carrying my melanin body, was passing left, right and center, I was doing fine girl, no people. That's the day that my village people saw that they would, they would bring out the tag from my clothes. So now, you know when things like this happen to you, you start imagining everything that is going on in other people's heads, even though that's not what's going on in their heads. So I was just imagining, ha, huh? hi God, that's how I take for my hands with this. Does it mean that ah, these people will be thinking that I just want to wear these clothes now and then go and return it? Ha! Ah, 
hey god do oh. like inside my head i was just thinking do you know what anna did hmm no wahala she me niger babe ph babe like me that ph girl i said no wahala i did my clothes very well took the thing back inside like it is nobody's business took it back inside wore my jacket the jacket because school was not coming wore the jacket used time and cut the thing allowed the thing to drop through my trouser and fell down i just used leg and covered the thing until when we were ready to go we started going it's not my business like it's not my business i said jennifer i can't stay there and be imagining what is going through other people's head because they saw the tag on my clothes it's not my business it's not my it has happened it has happened like it is not my business so i, I removed it though hmm, me but hey <laughs> god i removed it though after i removed it use my leg as a thing through my leg like this fell down on the ground i used my son that covered it when we finish as we're going i just walk out and left it concerned the person that saw it it is not my business you that saw it is your business is you that is thinking in your head it's not my business it does not concern me so <laughs> that was i felt a bit embarrassed at the start of it like when i just noticed it i felt a bit embarrassed but i was like um excuse you it is my money. It is me that bought it. So even though anybody is thinking that I want to return it's the person's business, nobody can come and ask me question. <laughs> so I said, ah, I beg. I just fashioned it and say, I'm not gonna stay here and be feeling embarrassed. I did my thing very well. You style and cut it, and the thing fell down through my leg. So <laughs> hallelujah, that one does not consign me. Anyway, so like it was really a funny scenario. Like, it was really funny scenario. Like, I hate things like this. I don't maybe wearing a clothes that is torn, and I don't know, especially if it is by the butt side. Or, you know, wearing clothes that the tag is still there, things like that. Ah, God. It makes me feel somehow, like, ah. But, hmm, it has happened, it has happened. That's what I told myself. So, hey, I'm going to do something and get out of the, you know, the shyness, the um, feeling, oh my God, feeling embarrassed. I had to do something to get out of it. And I told myself, I'm not going to remain in this state of embarrassment. So <laughs> anyways, that's what happened. And that's how I felt embarrassed a bit. And I just, hey. anyway, so if you've ever had this type of scenario, let me, I want to hear how you got out of your own situation. I want to hear how you got out of your own situation. Just you know what just let me know how it went and how were you able to get out of the embarrassing situation yes how did you how did you handle it so basically how did you handle it all right guys i would see you if that's where this video has come to an end yes so <laughs> i'm gonna see you in my next video all right bye <laughs>